the wave of golden light flows over the undulating dunes of the Thar Desert. The vast expanse of Thar is both haunting and beautiful. It's where silence roars and every grain of sand carries centuries of history. In this timeless ocean of sand, a new chapter on India's energy security is being written. The joy of striking black gold after relentless exploration efforts. After miles of barren rock, the earth finally whispers wealth. That euphoric moment when exploration turns into fortune. Here's the story of treasure beneath the sand. A story of grit, determination and perseverance of all India warriors. In financial year 2024-25, crude oil production has increased more than five-fold compared to financial year 2017-18. Production of heavy oil during last three years has increased 90%, 51% and 31% respectively over the preceding years. Hello and welcome viewers, you are watching this special presentation of Sunset TV on India's energy security with your host Kriti Mishra. In this edition, I will take you inside the fascinating world of exploration of oil and natural gas from the sandy terrains of Rajasthan. This journey is a reflection of technological triumph and strategic perseverance of India. Come with me on this unmissable journey. The Thar Desert, a land often described in golden hues and shimmering heat, is one of the most hostile terrains in India. Spanning across the states of Rajasthan and Gujarat, the desert stretches across more than 2 lakh square kilometers. To the naked eye, it's just an expanse of dunes, ravines, thorny bushes and scattered villages. But beneath this blanket of sand lies something far more precious untapped reservoirs of oil and gas. For decades, geologists have speculated that the Thar Desert may hide hydrocarbon pressures. And now, the spotlight is on Oil India Limited, a government-owned enterprise which has taken the bold step of venturing deep into these unforgiving lands to explore what lies beneath. Their mission is simple but monumental, to discover and harness domestic sources of oil and gas in Rajasthan. This is the story of how science, ambition and technology came together in the heart of the desert to write a new chapter in India's energy independence. India is the third largest energy consumer in the world, yet it imports nearly 85% of its crude oil needs. This dependence on foreign oil makes the Indian economy vulnerable to global price shocks, supply disruptions and geopolitical tensions. To reduce this reliance, the government has been encouraging domestic oil and gas exploration under schemes like the Hydrocarbon Exploration and Licensing Policy and Open Acreage Licensing Policy. Oil India Limited is one of India's oldest oil companies that has taken up this challenge by exploring new frontiers and the Thar Desert is one of the most promising.
every oil drop counts and every effort of Oil India Limited. So here we are in the remote corner of Rajasthan, working in extremely difficult conditions, the Oil India team, and introducing a new technology, the cyclical steam stimulation, an enhanced oil recovery mechanism used for the first time in India. So kudos to the Oil India team, which will take us to Vixit Bharat 2047. You might ask, why would anyone explore a barren desert for oil? Well, geological studies dating back to the British colonial era indicated the presence of sedimentary basins underneath Rajasthan. These basins are similar in structure to those in Gujarat and western offshore regions, which are known to have oil. Specifically, the Jaisalmer Basin, a part of Thar, has long intrigued geologists. It is characterized as a Category 1 basin, which means it has proven commercial production. Recent advances in seismic imaging and satellite surveys have confirmed that the region may have potential reserves of both oil and gas, including tight oil, shale gas and conventional crude. Oil India seized this opportunity and began its massive exploration operations in Barmer, Jaisalmer and Bikane regions. The two wellheads that we see in the backdrop, one is our DND-12, that's one wellhead which is producing gas at 50,000 standard cubic meters per day. The other one is DND-16, another wellhead. Now having done this, you would appreciate the kind of effort that must have gone into to explore this area and to produce from this area because we are supplying natural gas to the Indian economy. As far as Oil India is concerned, we, are, we produce about 10% of India's domestic production. Our people contribute to the energy basket of the country. And as far as Rajasthan sector is concerned, we produce crude oil from Baghewala field, and we produce natural gas from our Tanoth field and Dandewala field. And just to share with your August audience, Kriti, uh, our petroleum mining lease is juxtaposed to the international border. And our, we have multiple well locations one of the location that we have recently got as part of the discovered small field uh, auction number three, the Bakri Tibba, that will be one of our fastest monetization effort. All India is a Maharatna, central public sector undertaking within the Ministry of Petroleum and Natural Gas. And it began hydrocarbon exploration in the Thar Desert of Rajasthan in the early 1980s. The Rajasthan project was established in 1983 with Petroleum Exploration Licence granted in January 1985 and the first seismic survey was conducted the same year. However, in 2019, the project was restructured as Rajasthan Fields with an asset basin structure aligning with the field headquarters. All India currently holds three petroleum mining leases in Rajasthan, the Jaisalmer PML including the Dandewala, the Note and Bagi Tibba gas feeds. The Bagiwala PML spanning 202.6 square kilometers within the Bagiwala heavy oil field and the recently acquired BSF PML covering 66.67 square kilometers. In 1988, Oil India established natural gas reserves in the Tanot structure within the Jaisalmer basin of Rajasthan. Later, commercial quantities of natural gas were also confirmed in the Dandiwala and Bagi Tibba fields. Commercial gas production began in 1996 from these fields, which are approximately 150 kilometers from Jaisalmer. To operate its oil field, Oil India utilizes its production facility. Additionally, there is a permanent base camp, the Tanot village complex, located near the Tanot BSF camp. Gas extracted from the Dandiwala and Bagi Tibba fields is collected at the central Dandiwala gas processing complex. These facilities include many forts, process vessels, a glycol dehydration unit, glycol reboiler, condensate recovery vessels and custody transfer meters. The processed gas is metered and then dispatched to Gale India Limited for distribution to the final customer. In a significant breakthrough occurred in November 2018 when Oil India successfully implemented India's first 
cyclic steam stimulation project, a thermal enhanced oil recovery method for extracting the heavy crude oil from Jodhpur sandstone. In the pilot well, BGW8. It is worth mentioning here that this recovery process was introduced for the first time in Asia in Rajasthan. Oil India warriors operate in climatic conditions categorized by extreme temperature and dry conditions. The hot weather is very prolonged and starts from the month of April to the end of August. The maximum and minimum recorded ambient temperature at the site is 55 degrees Celsius and minus 1 degree Celsius respectively. The rainfall in these areas is scanty and scarce. भारत सरकार की जो रिसेंटली रिफॉर्म्स हुई है उसमें एक कदम था कि एक्सप्लोरेशन को कैसे बढ़ावा दी जाए और उसके तहत सरकार ने क्या क्या किया कि एक ओपन एक्रेज लाइसेंसिंग पॉलिसी के तहत ब्लॉक्स अलोकेट किए उसके साथ साथ जो छोटे छोटे डिस्कवरी हुए थे और मोनिटाइज नहीं हो पाए थे उस तरह के ब्लॉक्स को चूज करके डी डिस्कवर्ड स्मॉल फील्ड की कैंपेन शुरू की गई थी और ये जो हम बाखरी टिब्बा की जगह की बात कर रहे हैं जहाँ पे आज हम बैठ खड़े हैं ये डी एस एफ थ्री राउंड की ब्लॉक है और ये सबसे पहले हमने मोनिटाइज किया है अब हमने यहाँ गैस प्रेजेंस इस्टाब्लिश करके गैस डिस्कवर करके सानू फॉर्मेशन से करीब 960 मीटर की डेप्थ से हम गैस प्रोड्यूस करेंगे और यहाँ पे हमने तीन वेल ड्रिल किए हैं और इससे हम गैस प्रोड्यूस करके दांडे वाला की जो हमारी गैस प्रोडक्शन सेंटर है वहां भेजेंगे और वहां से फिर पाइपलाइन से चला जाएगा लेट्स टेक अ लुक एट द ब्रेक डाउन ऑफ व्हाट ऑयल इंडिया इज डूइंग इन दीस डिफिकल्ट टेरेन्स सेस्मिक सर्वेस यूजिंग 2D एंड 3D सेस्मिक टेक्नोलॉजी ऑयल इंडिया मैप्स अंडरग्राउंड रॉक फॉर्मेशंस वाइब्रेटिंग ट्रक्स जनरेट शॉक वेव्स दैट पेनिट्रेट द अर्थ एंड रिफ्लेक्ट बैक रिवीलिंग हिडन स्ट्रक्चर्स drilling exploratory wells once seismic data shows promise oil india begins drilling exploratory wells each costing 20 to 40 crore on average if oil or gas is found in these wells they are followed by appraisal and development wells hydrocarbon testing and logging sophisticated tools measure pressure temperature and fluid composition deep inside the earth this helps oil india determine the quality and quantity of oil or gas environmental safeguards given the sensitivity of the desert ecosystem all india has made environmental impact assessments mandatory before drilling they also use zero liquid discharge systems to prevent contamination the economic benefits of this successful discovery in thar are massive energy security every barrel of oil produced domestically reduces the import bill jobs oil india's operations have generated thousands of direct and indirect jobs from rig workers to logistics providers infrastructure boost remote villages are getting roads water supply and even electricity piggy banking on oil india operations local economy rajasthan could see royalty revenues boosting the state gdp and local development From the sands of silence to the thrum of oil rigs, the Thar Desert is undergoing a transformation. What was once thought barren is now brimming with potential. Through courage, innovation and science, All India Limited is scripting a bold new chapter, one that could redefine India's energy landscape. But this is just the beginning. Whether the Thar becomes a reliable source of domestic energy will depend on how responsibly sustainably and innovatively india pursues this opportunity after all beneath every desert lies a story and this one could fuel a nation as we culminate this ground report after braving treacherous terrain and inclement weather i can only say that i'm deeply indebted to the energy and oil warriors of oil india Sir, tell us how was your experience? It was a fascinating experience. 
we are uh, not aware that in remote corners and in extreme difficult conditions we have our team india doing a wonderful job here in the remote corner of rajasthan we are discovering oil and gas which will cater to the energy needs of our country so kudos to the team that will take us to viksit bharat 2047 well viewers that's all we had for you in this edition reporting from international borders in the jaisalmer sector with ceo sansa tv mr rajit punhani camera persons nilesh and jitendra i'm kriti mishra signing off for sansa television programs of sunset tv subscribe to our youtube channel and don't forget to like and share them